Hey there guys, John Campy here for Collider Video, and this is my quick review of the brand new Clint Eastwood film, Sully. Now, Sully follows the true events of 2009 when Captain Sullenberger, Sully, had to set his passenger airliner down in the Hudson River after a flock of birds hit his plane, taking out both engines. Now, if you're like me, you're kind of wondering, well, wait a minute, how does an event that took place over 208 seconds get stretched out into full-length feature film? But that question is answered right away. Clint Eastwood does an incredible job here of taking the story of Sully and taking it from a fantastical, amazing event of, you know, Captain Sully having to land that plane in the water and making it a truly and deeply human story. Not just focusing on Captain Sully himself, which, you know, played brilliantly by Tom Hanks is so well done, but also looking at it from the point of view of his co-pilot, played by Aaron Eckhart, who was just fantastic in everything is he's in, but not just the two of them either. The movie also takes a brief look ever so slightly every once in a while at the captain of the ferry boat who raced to the plane's rescue, the members of the National Guard who raced out to their helicopter to go out and help people, the lives of the people who were actually on board of the plane. By going back and forth between revisiting the incident of the plane going down into the Hudson River, juxtaposing that against the human experiences of people approaching the event in the first place, what Clint Eastwood manages to accomplish, like I said at the beginning, is a deeply human story. You don't feel like this is the story about an airline going down. You feel like this is the story of the people involved in the events that surrounded it. And on that level, Sully is a real gem of a movie. When you see the plane going down, it's exciting and it's thrilling and you're holding on to the edge of your seat all at the same time, but it never takes away from that what is the human experience within these moments. Now, Clint Eastwood also does something very interesting in the movie where he shows us the events of the plane losing engine power and going down, and then we go away to something else. And then we come back to the exact same uh, circumstances of the plane going down, then go away to something else, and then he revisits the plane going down again. You would think that would become repetitive, but instead what it does is he shows us an experience that one of the characters in the movie is going through and then goes back to the flight going down to kind of give us a different perspective on the flight itself and on the experience the character is having. I don't want to give any spoilers away, but this little technique, which I haven't seen used very often by Clint Eastwood of going to the flight going down and then back out, then back to the event again, then back out, then back to the event again, was actually used really effectively and I feel added to the emotional impact of the story as a whole. Look, I don't know if Sully's going to end up in my top 10 films of the year, but this is a truly enjoyable film. And you know, one of the great things to me, and I almost got a little bit choked up in the movie watching it, is something happens. As a human race, we are a rotten bunch of people. But sometimes when tragedy happens or when disaster strikes, it tends to bring out the best in us. And I love seeing a movie that reminds us that within all human beings, there is that capacity to rise up and do something exceptional when faced with incredible need from our fellow man. And not just the heroics of Captain Sully, but also the boat pilots, the helicopter pilots, the fire department members, the police people, everybody who pitched in to help to save all those people on that plane. It really lets me come out of the movie theater with this great sense of hope. Anyway, overall on a scale of 1 to 10, I give Sully a 7.5 out of 10. I think it's a movie you need to go rush out and see. And hey, while you're here, why not take some time and check out some of these other reviews we've done here on Collider Video. That'll do it for us. My name's John Campio. Thanks for joining us. And until next time, bye-bye.